this test is conducted under the 38, the ASTM D3806 test method. It is known as the equivalency test for the ASTM E84. The test specimen you're going to witness being subjected to the test is half inch, otherwise known as 15 30 seconds plywood. It has been subjected to the ASTM D2808, the standard test methods for accelerated weathering of fire retarded treated wood for fire testing. This test is usually conducted for four minutes. However, we're going to double that time to an eight minute test to show you the effectiveness of Flame Safe's fire retardant coatings. The particular product that we used on this specimen is Fire Poly FP75E. It is an exterior fire retardant coating that flame safe warrants for five years or 200 inches of rain, whichever comes first. The uniqueness of flame safe's fire poly FP75E and in relation to the ASTM D3806 test is that the ASTM 3806 references not only the flame spread but it has to do with after flaming. The afterglow time observed, the panel consumption, degree of, and degree of intermittence, as well as the insulation value of the coating. It is important to note, during this test, you will see the effectiveness of FlameSafe's insulating value of, on the test specimen. Periodically during this test, we are going to re turn off the lights so that you can actually see the flame as it, it approaches the specimen and the intermittent insulation value of the product. Flame Safe Fire Poly FP75E is a high intermittent coating. At the completion of this test, we will actually measure the height of the intermittence. The intermittence refers to an expansion of the carbon char in regard to the flame spread. This is very important because this is what insulates the flame from the substrate that has been treated.
The amount of gas being consumed during this test is 4.8 cubic feet per minute. This test method provides a relative flame spread of the coating using the small test specimens. By calibrating the two-foot tunnel with test method ASTM E84 rated fire retardant coating, results obtained by this test method are indicative of those obtained with the large specimen in the test method E84 tunnel test. The test on this product was conformed and adapted by FlameSafe and the results were indicative of the test performed at Southwest Research Institute on fire, uh, fire retarded plywood coating. The Fire Poly FP75E test at the Southwest Research Institute showed a flame spread index of less than five, which correlates almost exactly to the ASTM D3806 test that you are watching at the present time. During this test, you will see the height of the endomissions if you can possibly zoom in to the flame at the top of the burner and the relation to that flame to the expansion that has created on the intermissive coating. At this point there is less than one half inch distance between the flame and at the top of the burner to the bottom of the coating. That shows an expansion rate of approximately one and a half inches or 1500 mils. This coating was applied at approximately four mils, which equates to six hundredths of a pound per square foot, or 200 square feet per gallon. At this point, we're going to remove the test specimen from the burner. And please take note and observe the amount of intimacy that has been created. If you will note, the intimacy is approximately three times higher than the thickness of the panel. We're going to turn the specimen over to show you the back side of the panel. If you'll notice on the back side of the panel,
There is, it is not hot, just slightly warm, showing you the effectiveness of the insulation value of flame safe's high intermissive coatings.